Well, good morning there, Stoddard students, and happy Tuesday. Yes, we are in a very special location this morning. We are in the National Academy of the Sciences. And yes, we're here with our great friend, Albert Einstein. Say hello to Albert. Yes. So today is April 14th, 2020. A couple student shout outs today is going out to Tilly, BB, and Ryan Hutt for support, for sending in those challenge 24 answers. Um, another big shout out to Tilly because, hey, she not only turned in her STEM project, but she actually taped herself. And I'm very looking forward to her creativity and checking that out. So shout out to you, Tilly. Challenge 24 numbers for today. Problem one, one, three, nine, and five. I repeat, one, three, nine, and five. Problem number two is 12, 14, 10, and five. I repeat, 12, 14, 10, and five. Our quote of the day, if you can't explain it simply, you don't understand it well enough. I repeat, if you can't explain it simply, you don't understand it well enough. And that quote came from who else but Mr. Einstein himself. So students, remember, if you're just trying to get to the answer, that's great that you can get to the answer, but can you explain it to someone else to help them understand it? Mm. Moving right along. Our core value for this week is respect. And one of the reasons why I came to this site specifically is because I respect this man so much. His curiosity, um, the way that he never gave up on science, he had to persevere, not everything always went his way, but he turned out to be one of these people that we look up to and we will never forget about. Him. Student tips for today. Use your time wisely, students. I'm seeing a lot of stuff on your posts and your chats that you're just putting in letters, putting in memes. Hey, that's all great and fun. But remember, when we're learning and your teacher is teaching, remember that we have to stay focused and we have to use our time wisely to get our work done. Parent tips of the day. Hey, hold your students to high expectations, parents, okay? Don't worry, students, everything is okay, I promise. Parent tips, hold your students to high expectations. Believe that they can do it. Pump them up. Let them know that, hey, my expectations, I believe that you do it. I, you can do it. I know that you can do it. Hey, if we hold our expectations down here, they may never reach their goals that they set out to. So parents, hold those high expectations. And remember, if they fall or they fail, say, hey, that's a part of the learning process, okay? And have them persevere through it. Um, STEM, hey, there's been a lot of great questions around STEM. I'm getting pictures, I'm getting the answers question, okay? But I wanna go over a few things, okay? First and foremost, this STEM project, the Design Challenge Invent a Vehicle, okay? It is due April 19th, 2020. You can submit the questions via Office 365 in a Word document. Okay, April 19th, 2020, Office 365 in a Word document. Now, the materials and supplies, it has a list. Do you have to use them, students? That is right. No, you can be as creative as you want. Can you use some of the materials and supplies on the list? Yes, but you don't have to stick to those. Be creative. Next, hey, I'm getting all these great pictures of you building them, but remember, this is a design. Make sure that you decorate it, make it your own. Nobody wants you to just build a piece of paper um, out of a white piece of paper. Boring. 
boring. Womp, womp, womp. Hey, make it exciting and make it your own, students. You've done the hardest part. Now have some fun with it. Moving right along, remember that the balls or whatever that you're transporting is the hazard waste. So they suggest that you use marbles. If I don't have marbles, I may use rocks. Your vehicle has to transport this hazard waste, meaning the marbles and or the rocks across water and across land. Remember, you're taking it from our neighborhood and Glover Park out into a very safe place. Okay, so if you have any questions or concerns, please reach out to me. I don't want this something that you're just doing at the last minute and submitting. Please take your time and use your time wisely. All right, hey, our shout outs um, today go to all the teachers across the nation and even internationally, okay? We need to keep working together, giving each other's resources. We need to keep building each other up because we are in this together. If you have an idea, find a teacher to share it with in the next, next district or um, even somebody you may see on Facebook or whatever. We need to stick together in these uncertain times. There may be times that we're feeling down, but you are not alone and we can build each other up. So, hey, this is Mr. McCants. Hey, I'm signing off from the National Academy of Sciences, all right? Hey, and I don't know, maybe you guys want to visit this one day or maybe you've already been here, but saying bye to Mr. Albert Einstein. Thank you for joining us this morning. Signing off. Have a great day on purpose, students. Bye.